It's been 10 years since the legendary Sir Alex Ferguson, with a heavy heart, confided in his wife Kathy during Christmas 2012, saying, I'm going to retire. Little did the world know that this revelation would set in motion a carefully orchestrated plan, shrouded in secrecy, culminating in Ferguson's unexpected farewell from one of football's most prestigious managerial roles. It's been 10 years, and the echoes of that decision are still felt. Stick around as we unravel the details that were kept under wraps until the last moment. Before we dive into the secrecy, let's quickly recap Sir Alex Ferguson's remarkable career. The most decorated manager in British football, he achieved unparalleled success during his time at Manchester United and Aberdeen, securing numerous titles and trophies. His decision to retire in 2013 sent shockwaves through the football world. As we rewind to April 2013, only a select few were privy to Ferguson's impending departure. The club orchestrated a plan to keep the news tightly under wraps, involving a circle of trust and a carefully crafted narrative. The pivotal moment came with a lone voice declaring, the king is dead, long live the king, leaving those in the know stunned. Fast forward to May 8, 2013, the day of the official announcement. Despite meticulous planning, the news broke prematurely, causing frustration for Ferguson. He had envisioned a different scenario, but the cat was out of the bag. In a series of brief meetings, he apologized to his closest staff, confirming his retirement. The announcement didn't disrupt preparations for the final two games. Staff members, players, and even the media were caught off guard. Ferguson, who had been actively involved in planning future seasons, revealed no signs of the momentous decision he had made. As the final games approached, Ferguson penned his last program notes, expressing his gratitude and reflecting on his tenure. The atmosphere at Old Trafford was both serious and tense. The official announcement was meticulously prepared in the war room, anticipating the surge of visitors that temporarily overwhelmed the club's website. Ferguson's farewell at Old Trafford was emotional, accompanied by songs like My Way and Unforgettable. The final lap of the stadium with his grandchildren marked the end of an era. A week later, at West Brom, the players presented him with a 1941 Rolex watch and a book of memories, bringing closure to a legendary career. As we reflect on the secrecy, the emotions, and the farewell, it's undeniable that Sir Alex Ferguson's retirement was a defining moment in football history. The legacy he left behind is still evident in the impact he had on Manchester United and the sport as a whole. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel for more football content, and share your thoughts in the comments below. Until next time, this is Footballistica, signing off.